Hello everyone, Simicraft here. Welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Uh, last episode we uh, did a shrine. And that is all we did last episode, actually. You know, sometimes I really feel that I am not the most uh, efficient Zelda player out there. But hey, uh, hopefully today we'll get a bit more done. We're heading towards uh, Mount Slaneru, ideally, which should hopefully yield us a memory, because I believe one of the memories should be right there like at the base of Mount Lanayru, as well as, uh, we believe, the Spring of Wisdom is likely there, which might be similar to the Spring of Courage, in which case it probably has a shrine, but uh, who knows? And we, of course, know the Spring of Wisdom is there because we saw it in one of the memories we got back, uh, the one with, like, the horse statue. So. Hopefully we're actually correct. Uh, we can bomb this. And, of course, all of the ore tumbles off the side of the cliff, but, uh, whatever. That's fine. Round two? Okay, that didn't even blow it up. And try again. Here we go, here we go. Oh, come on. Why do I even bother sometimes? This is the question I ask myself. But, uh, yeah. So we'll climb up to the peak of this, and hopefully we can get a good idea of where we're going to once we're at the top here. Uh, we need to head... The direction we're not facing, I believe. So yeah, we'll we'll just summit this. That's what we should do. I like these cliffs that aren't quite as so steep that you need to uh, always climb, or you fall off and die. So, I wonder if there's going to be anything on the top of this particular mountain. Uh, I wouldn't necessarily expect it, but... Oh, it's cold up here. Should probably get the old doublet on. There we go. Warm doublets. Aha. Uh -huh. Huzzah. Warm doublets. We've done it. Okay. And all the way up here. Is there going to be a quark here? Yeah, you found me. And a cork seed. Thank you. Bye bye. Let's uh, just throw this down the mountain, I guess. Yeah. Speaking of going down the mountain, perhaps. Also, look at that volcano there. Yo, we really should go there after Mount. Is that a? That's a moving thing. That's probably is a divine beast. Uh, we'll mark that definitely. And that should be where we go after we're done here in Mount Lanero. We go up there to that volcano. I believe the name of the volcano is Death Mountain. Lots of clouds up at the top of Mount Lanier. It's interesting. But that's where we're wanting to head. So, let's do it. Although we are kind of going to be looking for um, the memory. So, I believe there should be a gate like... Oh, like that. Yeah. That's probably what their memory is. So, we'll be going straight there. And the question is, by what means? Oh, okay, so that water thing leads to there. So if I had actually, like, not had that raft just... If I had bothered to not get that raft stuck, so yeah, that, that gate is definitely the right one. Then, uh, we would have been able to get this memory, like, first. So, uh, let's shield surf. Or, that didn't work. Let's shield, let's shield surf, haha. Okay, man, getting hurt. Okay. Maybe not the best mountain for shield surfing. Oh, uh, there's a rush room. I like rush rooms. I think. Alright, let's try again. Shield surf! Woo! Alright, yeah, shield surfing. I don't think I'm very good at shield surfing. 
Yeah, we'll just glide because that's what I'm decent at. And here we are. Uh, is this one in particular the one, or is there another one further on? Ooh, hello, Moblin. Alright, Moblin, you're not even gonna see this coming, I don't think. Because I... Oh! Oh, okay, you saw it coming. Sorry. Alright, Moblin. Ooh, Flurry Rash, you're dead. Well, technically not quite dead yet, but whatever. Okay, this time you will die. Almost certain. Okay, not quite, but you know, close. Let's use a broadsword. Thank. You. Okay, dead. Awesome. Uh, Spike Dark Cup isn't the best, but uh, I mean, I'll take it. Yeah, I mean, any weapon is better than no weapon at all in this game. Although it'd be cool if you could like. As like you just you know go fisticuffs with the enemies, you know. Pull out the old fist and give him a good whacking. Lanayru Rude East Gates. Okay. Yeah, memory. Here we go. Keep us in suspense. How'd everything go up there on the mountain? <laughs> so you didn't feel anything? No power at all? I'm sorry. Then let's move on. You've done all you could. Feeling sorry for yourself won't be of any help. After all, it's not like your last shot was up there on Mount Lanayru. Anything could finally spark the power to seal Ganon away. We just have to keep looking for that... thing. That's kind of you. Thank you. If I may... I thought you... well, I'm not sure how to put this into words. I'm actually quite embarrassed to say it. But I was thinking about what I do when I'm healing. You know, what usually goes through my mind. It helps when I think... when I think about... Stop wasting time. We're gonna need everything we got to take that thing down. Now, champions, to your divine feasts. Show that swirling swine who's boss. Link will need to meet Ganon head on when we attack. This needs to be a unified assault. Little guy, you get to Hyrule Castle. You can count on us for support, but it's up to you to pound Ganon into oblivion. Come, we should go. We need to get you someplace safe. No. I'm not a child anymore. I may not be much use on the battlefield. But there must. There must be something I can do to help. Oh, OK. 
Okay. So that is what the uh, return of Ganon was like. And uh, yeah, now we'll get to go up to Mount Lanero, which definitely has the uh, Spring of Wisdom, right? Definitely. Oh, what's over there? A mob pool? Oh. That's... A Lionel. And it spotted me. Um... Okay, best equipment. Let's do this. Haven't, uh... Actually defeated any of these before. Bomb arrows should theoretically be more effective, right? But... Uh... Wind cleaver? It's my best weapon. Alright. Ice arrows, okay. Oh, okay. That's... A strike against me. I uh, definitely needed some food, definitely. Mighty simmered fruit? Tough vegetable risotto? Frozen bass. Um, sneaky steamed fruit. And then how about the tough fruits? Right? The, or tough vegetables. Or no, we'll go for attack up. So we're gonna get some good hits while we have. Okay. Can I at least hit him like once? Oh, okay. Ha 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 ha. Don't. Okay, I'm dead. Um. Less than ideal, right there. Ah, uh, ha 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 We... I mean, we're gonna have to get through this guy to get to Mount Lanayru, right? And theoretically, we could go around, but... You know, it's about time we defeat one of these, so let's get our best equipment on. Also, good thing the save point is right here. Definitely want my actual boots, my high-end trousers on. Here we go. Okay, let's make sure we're at full health, we'll eat the sneaky steam fruit, and actually with this we might be able to sneak all the way- We might be able to sneak up on him. Maybe. We'll see. So we'll climb up here and see- we'll try to get an advantage. Maybe, uh, go around and then sneak up from behind or some such thing? Oh, he's got the question mark, gotta be cautious. Looks like he doesn't suspect a thing anymore. Oh, he suspects something. You don't see nothing. Okay. He's still facing up. Oh, he saw me. Gosh darn. Uh, I'm just gonna... Okay, pulling out the bow. That's less than ideal. Is he going to shoot at me? Or is he just gonna stand there looking tough? I wonder. Um, hmm. What to do? We might be able to book it. Or, or... Here we go. Shoot him in the face. Okay. Alright. Alrighty, I'm been hit. Let's see, let's see. Um... Tough visual risotto, that ought to lessen the damage from other hits, right? Oh, okay, my my sword is powerful. Okay, I dodged that. All right. Oh, okay. Come on, come on. Okay, if I could get a ah. Uh, uh, okay, okay, we can do this. We can do this. I need to dodge better so I can maybe get like a flurry strike. That would be good. I think it's actually called a flurry rush. Is what it is. Definitely going to want to get me one of those. Or actually, we're going to need a lot more than one. So if we go for maybe a one-handed weapon, actually. We get this tough stuff immediately. So we get that defense up. 
And a one-handed weapon may be more advantageous, because then we can actually use the shield. I'm not quite sure how effective the shield will be against someone of this strength, but let's just get some arrows off on him. Okay, we hit him. Okay. Immediately hit by ice arrows. That's not ideal. Okay. Shield out. Here we go. Oh, the shield does work. Okay. Hey, you. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah, shields are effective. Good. Oh. Alright. We might be able to actually do this. What's this attack? Hey. Oh, okay, mistimed that dodge there. But yeah, yeah, we were doing much better with the shield, so definitely going to be using the shield now. Or one-handed weapon, so we can also use the shield. Okay, okay, I think we can do this. We were landing some hits. If we can get the flurry rush, of course, that would be even better. Let's make sure we got all our best stuff. Get the tough visual risotto. Yep. And, uh, oh, my, uh, trousers. My trousers need to be better. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Let's do this. Good, good. Alright, alright. Come on. Come at me. Okay. Yeah, just try your hand at the melee. Yeah, Flurry Rush. Take that. And he bleeds! Well, I mean, not literally. This game is not... You know, they wouldn't want to go for the old M rating, but... Figuratively. Certainly. Oh, yeah. Take that, you stupid centaur-like... Dude. Also, my broadsword is badly damaged. So, hopefully, it doesn't break on us. Let's go for archery. Oh, or maybe not. Ah, uh, yeah. Archery, not the best idea. Going to eat some food now. Some mighty simmered fruit. Yeah. Yeah. And that'll make our attacks even stronger. Alright, come on. Come on. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Broadsword is broken. Ow. Going to need to eat some more food. Uh alright, alright, alright. We We're still mighty. Uh, we're going to need another weapon now. Uh, we've got another broadsword, so we'll go with that, I guess. Come on. Okay. Yep, thanks. Okay, we can do this. We're about... Oh. That was just bad timing on our part, sir. Oh, no! Okay, we got it to, we to about halfway. Halfway. That's not bad. That's not bad. We can definitely do this. We can manage this, I think. Let's do it. We can do it. Yes, we can. Yes. Yes, we can. Yes, we can. Four more years. Let's go. Well, hopefully this isn't four more years of this. I'm confident our abilities should be able to actually do this, hopefully, please. And I am very aware that that statement doesn't exactly exude confidence, so... Pretend I made a similar statement, except one that actually does exude confidence. Alright. Come at me, beastie. Just you and me. I'm gonna even shoot you with an arrow. Or perhaps not. Because apparently I'm not strong enough to do that. I am bad at this. Oh, and I'm frozen. Okay. Not the best way. Okay, not the best way to start this off. Certainly. Okay, but we can do it. We can do it. 
Come on. Oh yeah, get that side dodge. Nice, we are mighty. Oh yeah, flurry rush it. You won't even know it hit him. Also sneaking, not the best. Shields are great, I love shields. Man, remember back early in this game when I was completely just down on shields? I was like, what the heck, why would you ever need a shield? Or not shields specifically, but one-handed weapons? Dude, one-handed weapons are the best. We only have like one more though, so we're gonna have to make it count. Okay. Come on. What do you do? Yeah, get shot. Oh man. Shield didn't uh, fully protect from that damage. Nice, flurry rush it. Okay. Oh, 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 that's... Okay, that's fire. No. Okay, get shot. Oh! Ah, that was a close one. But flare rush is always good. Should probably eat a bit more food. I'll some more mighty simmered fruit. Even more attack up. There we go. Get that flare rush on the third strike. Love it. Okay, uh, he's almost dead. Uh, please don't kill me. Okay. Uh, he only has like 53 hells left. Come on, come on. We'll eat the spicy. And the tough. Okay, come on. You just need like one or two more good hits. What weapon? Uh, Dragon Mode Moblin Club? Maybe? With a Thunder Spear, Thunder Spear that. Well, we'll go for the Moblin Club. Because you only need to get like one hit in with this. <gasps> okay, that's not how we want to do that. It's on fire now. Okay. Oh my! We got launched! Please! Come on, we can do this! No, no, no. Okay, come on. Okay. Oh. Good. Didn't die. Get hit. Yes. Yes. We did it. Okay. My club is on fire. But it is done. Lionel Horn. Lionel Horn and Ice Arrow. Lionel Hoof. Lionel Sword. No, just normal sword. Lionel Shield. Lionel Bow? Okay, um... Is, Lina is Lionel Shields better than something we have, right? And the Bow, we can probably drop the Silver Bow, it's not really been that good. Lionel Bow. Okay, give me the Lionel Shield. Alright. Man! Okay, now on to Mount Lanera then, after doing that, we've got a Lionel Sword, which is pretty good. Oh, 24. 24 strength, single-handed weapon, that's decent, I like it. Especially since we don't have that many good single-handed weapons. But yeah, we'll go for the spear right now, because spears are cool. And please, game, auto-save soon, because... I would like that to go through. And be finalized that I did in fact defeat the Lionel. And it's cold here. So, uh, warmed up what it is. We're good. Some snow boots too. Okay. And here we go. Man, yeah, it suddenly got cold. So, this is Mount Lanaru. 
I presume we're probably going to want to summon it. Generally, I imagine that's a good thing to do. Also, let's get these chill shrooms because why the heck not? Hmm. Luckily, this doesn't seem to be an extremely cold area, so that's good. Hunting. Okay. Ice wolf. <laughs> Ooh, yikes. Raw prime meat. So oh, yeah. Yeah. Because food is a good thing. Generally speaking, one is. Feeding food is something that one should do. Oh, come on. It's got cold. And we don't actually have any warming foods. So that's less than ideal. I guess we'll just have to do the old tactic of just eating constantly. All right, let's get up here as quickly as we can. Man, I wish I had better cold gear. But I don't. So, uh, yeah. Although, I, mean, I guess it's realistic. I mean, not every cold place is going to be, uh, explorable just with, uh, the old, putting on the old jackets. Alright. Let's not waste too much time with combat. We've got to uh, get up this mountain. Like ASAP, get the mountain. Get up here. Come on, let's go. Because, I mean, I don't even know necessarily if this is going to be at the summit. It seems like it probably would, but I've got no evidence. So, yeah. We're going there just because that seems like the likely place for it to be. We've got this nice, like, spiral up to go up here, I guess. Hey, Choo Choo. Look with my spear, I've got some, like, long reach, which is nice. Yeah, that's one of the definite advantages of pole arms in this game. What? Did I just get frozen by a icy stone talus? That's crazy. A little baby one too, which is too cute, too cute. I love the baby ones. All right, moving on. It's a good thing I've got these snow boots that I've been borrowing from that guy in the desert for a while now. Never gonna actually give them back. Never gonna happen. Oh, oh, ah, oh, I didn't quite make it up. Well, I think we can climb up there. I know you're cold, Link, but it's fine. Eat a frozen bat. No, not a frozen bass. Uh, well, we should probably save the Enterprise Glazed Meat for when we're actually climbing, right? Alright, come on. Speed is of the essence. Okay. Gotta keep up the clock. Let's go. Ooh, okay, we're down to one heart. Energizing glazed beets, here we go. Alright, I think we're getting close, hopefully. Huh. It would be nice if I had the proper equipment to do this. We do have beef as grace, which means we can't afford to die. Whoa. What's this? Uh, 
That's interesting. I could probably shoot at it, right? Maybe if I get a bit closer. Oh. What is this? Is that not enough? Sheesh. Oh, is that like a dragon thing? It would seem to be. You have done well to find your way to this spring. Thanks, it wasn't easy. You who have overcome numerous trials and obtained the spirit orbs. The one you see before you is an attendant to the Spring of Wisdom. This is Nedra, the Blue Spirit of Leneru. This servant of the Goddess has looked over the, spir the spirits of this land for ages, unknown to the world of man. However, the dreaded malice unleashed by Calamity Ganon has possessed its body and reduced it to this state. You who have received the spirit orbs free, Nedra, from this malice, show what your power can achieve. Poor little dragon thing. Ah, oh, so we need to go for the giant eyes, and they're open now. Cool. Okay. Let's uh, give it a shot. Hit me with your best shot. Okay, man. There we go. Right, Nadra? Oh, where are you going, Nadra? Nadra, let, let me attend to the rest of your wounds. Alright, we gotta get up there, I guess, right? I don't know, we might be able to shoot from down here, but doesn't necessarily seem likely. Okay, we'll climb up there. Uh. Okay, yeah, th this isn't working from down here. We gotta get up there. Oh man, it is so cold! Oh, oh, cool. Updrafts. Mm. I also need to eat food. Man, we almost have no food left. Sheesh. We got heat resistance. Alright, come on. Let's do this. So climb up here. And I keep healing Nidra. Next episode. So until then, I've been Seamacraft, and I'll catch you in the next episode. Goodbye.